What's up guys, it's Dan from Adapt Gaming. Just a quick little update slash tutorial today. I, as you can see, I just got my Mac yesterday. iMac, uh, 21 and a half inch. Probably the cheapest one, but still at the Mac, so I'm happy. Um, what we're going to be talking about today is how to get Minecraft mods on a Mac. So with this, I'll, I'm going to show you step by step how to get it. And I'll kind of explain how to do it for um windows for people who don't know how to do it but this is gonna be a mainly tutorial for mac and i'll also put the pre-modded version of this in the description it'll be a media fire link so with that let's get started okay first thing what you want to do you want to open up safari firefox whatever your internet browser is and go to micro this is google zoom's mod pack i'll put the link in the description and install this or download this Give me a second and let it download. Boom, done. Okay. I'm just going to go ahead and drag this out here. And then, okay, what you want to do is you, you want to go make sure you're on Finder. Click Go, Home, Library, Application Support, and go down to Minecraft. Actually, wait, might be a better idea to do. I am going to go update real fast. Options, force update, done. Okay, if that happens, it's whatever. It's just because I have mods in there and it's being retarded. So I'm just going to go ahead and go to the library. And I'm just going to go just straight up delete that. Now I'm going to log in, get a new Minecraft. Yeah. Wait for it to download. It should take just a couple seconds. Okay, that's done. Okay, what you guys want to do is you want to open your Minecraft folder right here, new folder. Type in mods, go into the mods folder, new folder, and type in zone. Okay, now what you want to do is you want to go back, open up your bin folder, and for um for people who are on Windows, you're gonna right click and open with, and you're gonna do WinRAR or WinZip, whatever you use. For this, it's slightly different because you have actually have to um make a weird folder for it. So what I'm gonna do with this archive utility, it'll unpack it. I'm gonna add dot jar. See any of that? Click add. First things first I made a mistake. I'm sorry guys. Uh delete that. Now add dot jar. And what you want to do, open it up. I'm just going to search. I'm gonna, actually, I'm just going to scroll down until I find it. The meta.inf folder. There it is. Move to trash. Now what you want to do is you want to open up the zombie, the zone mod pack folder. Get the classes. Command A. Command C. And paste items. And apply to all replace. Okay, you're done with that. Now you want to go back out, back out, go to mods, zone, back out of this, go to config, and just hold on, command A, command C, paste items, go into your config.txt, and I'm just going to show you how to do this just for the zone the fly mod so I'm not going to show you how to I'll let you guys go through and figure out what, what all other mods you want to get for this to work you just come here remove the pound sign and then well, how I usually do mine is I do a, a toggle and I make that G up is E and I make my down R and then speed modifier key left shift 
and I go down to movement speed with multiplier with speed multiplier and I set it at 10.0 so 10.0 and I'm not gonna enable no clip or anything else like that and all you want to do exit save it, you can see it save right there close close As you can see, it didn't black screen. Everything looks like it's good. Go ahead and create a new world real fast. You're gonna have to go through, go down to options, controls. For sneak, I use it left control. Inventory, I use I. And then go ahead and get that out of the way. That is G. And there I go. As you can see, it says flying at the upper left hand corner. I'm averaging about 62 FPS right now, which actually is really good. And I just hit F, so yeah. Okay, guys. Thanks for watching. This has been a video from my dad gaming. Please comment, rate, subscribe.